and we start with a live look from our alabaster camera. We've got a mix of sun and clouds, more clouds than sun at this location right now, but that will be changing through the afternoon. We are anticipating a clearing trend. Here's a look at the satellite and radar over the last couple of hours. We had some showers in place. Those are out of here and notice that line of clouds that's going to keep moving southward as we move through the afternoon and into the evening. So those locations that aren't necessarily seeing the sun right now will see the sun over the next few hours. Here's where our temperatures are. We've got a mixture of 50s across central Alabama. Some of our northernmost communities are actually the warmest right now just because you are getting in on more of that sunshine. By the afternoon, forecasting a range of highs anywhere from the 60s north and west of the city of Birmingham to the 50s farther south you live. All of us are going to end up warmer than where we were yesterday afternoon. So let's break down the day hour by hour by about 4 p.m. We've got a temperature in the mid to upper 50s. We are starting to see more sunshine at that point across all of central Alabama. Then a nice clear sky through the evening that will allow us to cool very effectively overnight. So plan for 30s as you're headed out the door early tomorrow morning, heading out to work or school. Most locations are going to be sitting in the mid to upper 30s. Few spots could dip below the freezing mark, but most locations should hold above freezing. Over the next couple of days, we are looking at a really nice trend in the forecast. We've got dry weather in place through Thursday. Temperatures end up in the low to mid 60s. That is just above average for this time of year. Once again, we're dry through Thursday, but changes are on the way as we move towards the weekend. No rain through Thursday, but Friday is the day when I am bringing rain back into the forecast. Here's a look at 6 a.m. on Friday. Not going to be a weekend where it rains all day every day. But it is going to be a weekend where you want to have a backup for those outdoor plans. Here's a look towards 3 p.m. on Friday, heading into the evening hours on Friday. More of the same with rain looking more likely at this point along into the north of I-20 on Friday. Eventually Saturday and Sunday, that chance of rain does spread across all of central Alabama. So if you've got those outdoor plans, you're going to want to keep an eye on the forecast as we get closer to the weekend. Between now and Thursday, lots of sunshine highs in the 60s. The weekend is when we bring back that wetter weather. Sarah. All right. Thanks, Taylor.